ESPN Marvel. <laughs> what ESPN Marvel broadcast of last night's Warriors Pelicans game? Oh, so we had a Marvel. We had a Marvel so broadcast so last night. I couldn't. Five minutes of it. It was. I got so a headache. Cringy. I got a headache like, from watching it. Like, there was just so much going on the screen. It, it was just so unnecessary. The commentators were terrible. So, and so annoying. It was just really? both canned lines. It. it this cross promotion bullshit think, just pisses me off. Think so Nickelodeon much. football will, but like a Less million football. times worse. Uh, <laughs> a million times. Worse. Nickelodeon Trubisky MVP. Well, that was like fine. MVP. Like that was totally cool. Yeah. This was just like just all over the place. What was so bad about it? Just like they had graphics everywhere. Like anything any player did, there was just something that would pop up on the screen. During free throws, Iron Man was just sitting on the backboard. Of the yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Seth Curry hits a three, then a, a smoke thing, a Black Panther comes up. What does what? he have to do with it Seth Curry hitting a three? Pointless. And yeah. the, the, I don't know. the only good part about it was when um, Zion airballed a three and there was like a smoke stream that came from the ball. I think it, was an, it wasn't meant to be. Yeah, there's Iron Man. Look, just chilling. Iron right, man, what are you doing? <laughs> She's just hanging out. I mean, it, it was just—it was literally like you just did acid or LSD and just watch basketball. That's the like, scoreboard I, like, looks there's cool. There's really no other way to describe it. That scoreboard looks cool though. No one's watching the scoreboard. Everyone's. It's cool. a nice little. It's a it's I a nice touch, scoreboard. right? I, would, I wouldn't have minded if, like, if yeah. it was just like a couple graphics yeah. or whatever. Yeah, that's yeah. the like thing. That. But they went so overboard. So overboard. Everyone had hero points, which I still don't really know how it works. What's hero points? It's like fantasy. Like it's fantasy like you points, get points yeah. for points, rebounds, assists. You get negative points if you have a turnover or you miss a shot. Draymond Green had 48 <laughs> hero points last night. In case anyone was wondering. Heroic. Yeah, I mean it's <laughs> like. He saved basketball. But Sorry, for what's hero points? I, they're like fantasy points, and like I don't know. There's I just some, explained I this to you. <laughs> yeah. Explain it to me. Just, explain it to me like I'm five. He, there's really no other way. Point? Are you know, fantasy, you know, fantasy sports? Like fantasy? You get points. Yeah. I, when you get a point, a rebound, and assist, you get points. Okay. You get a turnover, you get deducted points. So okay. You a shot, you make a shot, deducted, add points. Okay. You finish with 48 overall. Okay. Casey, we're here. I'm here. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, John. I needed that. Thank you. Come on, play with the keys, son. Come on. Oh, strip them, strip them. <laughs> get the keys, get the keys. I need to get locked, here we go, locked big guy. back in. Come on. What the yeah, fuck is that? I don't know. I mean, I, I, in their head, we were talking about this. I feel like when they like planned this out and thought about it in their heads, like, oh, yeah, this is going to be really cool. Like, great no. idea. People are going to love it. And then it just happens, and they're like, well, I don't know if this was I, it. I don't even think that's the, their forethought. The thing is, really so, tonight, so, part, so part of this is tonight, ESPN is doing another broadcast of uh, the Yankees-Astros game with mm-hmm. a Star Wars broadcast. Because today's, oh. today's May 4th. May the 4th. Happy Star Wars Day, everyone. Oh, by the way. oh, oh that's uh, it. Happy Star May Wars Day. May the 4th, May the 4th be, with be with you guys. guys. No, how come you didn't wish us a happy Star Wars Day? Yeah, not yeah, not. Yeah, not. You think you're such a Star Wars guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fuck but is wrong with you? The fourth will always. The, the the issue is, and my main main aesthetic thing with this is like I have no problem with like what Nickelodeon did with their broadcast. It was fun. It was different. It didn't go above and beyond. It was like simple stuff. It felt, it felt like this was a Marvel ad and a basketball game broke out. It, it it's it's just like the corporatization of everything of sports, and this is part of my whole thing with like how the bastardization of sports in the last decade or so, where it's been for profit, it is like this is beyond those paths. Where you know our culture has become a monolithic culture, where mm. which I mean like everything is kind of the same. Well, where that's you have, it's Disney. It's exactly, Disney. it's uh, it's the the the, the, re, the way that you own everything. They own everything. You know, companies. They're like six companies anymore. It's Amazon, it's Disney, and it's like a handful of other companies like Facebook that own like everything. Run while you can. 